Hey, what up YouTube? What up Z Clan? What up everybody else? Welcome to my Fallout 76 where to find those outfits. Now in this uh, video we're gonna look for the uh, military fatigue outfit, the one I'm wearing right now. And this video is dedicated to 56 Hertz because he's been asking around. Also he mentioned he'd been here but he was not able to find it. So uh, I'm gonna, sh in order to find it you'll need to go to the dining hall, through the dining hall. There are a lot of different entrance to this place and uh, but in order to find those you, the sorry <laughs> the military physiques you'll need to go through the dining hall now I'm gonna cut out all the killing parts and I'll show you the exact location running as soon as we enter so for example right now if we enter we're gonna have a bunch of dudes and I will show you how to run directly to that place starting from this location here Alright, so I clear out the way to the military fatigue. So once you enter the dining room, you see that no access, right? There's This place is pretty cool actually, it has a lot of good loot and uh, a lot of plastics. Uh, my main resource is plastic because I bulk everything, plus sometimes I need, uh, need it for ammo. But in order to get to the military fatigue, so you enter from there, you walk straight, turn right, walk straight, jump over this... Uh, things over here uh, why sometimes I can do it okay fine don't need to jump you can just bypass it my bad <laughs> oh yeah sorry I'm um, where my overweight so then you walk through the cell block a you go to the showers and bingo we got our military fatigues ladies and gentlemen and what else do we have here? Uh, Rad stack hide outfit. Now this one changes all the time. Military fatigues is always there. I found it already four times now. Four. So and it's an exact same location. So it's definitely there. Now I will also show you some bonus uh, finds because there are a lot of good freaking outfits in this location. I'm trying to record here. Stop shooting. <laughs> All right. So, military fatigues in the showers. Now let's get on to the bonus loot and see what we find else here. Now, okay. Uh, these are some bonus outfits, as I promised. The military fatigues were already found, and I've shown it to you. It's by the way, just in case, in exactly the same place, right? So you need to find the laundry place, and this is one of the three I think locations where you can find a lot of outfits like in this one we can find the scavenger outfit the prisoner collar prisoner there are a lot of prisoner collars in this place if you look careful uh, oh, what was that I just picked up uh, prisoner collar scavenger outfit uh, and straight jacket Let's see how it looks Look like a psychopath in this one, although I cannot really see it that clearly because it's dark in here. And there's another one, another stray jacket. <laughs> so, this is one of the places where there's a lot of stuff, right? And oh my god, we found a minigun in this place as well. What the hell? I'm telling you, luck really indicates. Oh my freaking, a freaking minigun! I got a daddy. Jesus! I've been here so many times and previously I did not find this stupid minigun. Damn! Too bad I can't wear it though. Oh yeah. Look at that baby. What the hell is wrong with... Oh no, that's... <laughs> Lol. Okay. <laughs> but I'm still happy though. <laughs> Alright, so here's uh, some more. By the way, I found myself a new ar wooden armor. <laughs> uh, here's some more outfits. Drifter outfit. I usually always find it here, as I said before in previews. Hooded rags. Okay, those are never found before. That means they pretty much change. More drifter outfits. These locations change, so you can find some other outfits. So it's. What? Something else that you can find here. Eventually, guys, there's a lot of stuff you can find here. I mean, a lot. So you should definitely come here. I come here all the time just for the 
uh, leveling because there are a lot of uh, creatures over here. They can be super mutants or scorch or ghouls. It changes all the time. Obviously, I like when it's more mutants because you get more XP from those dudes. But everybody else is good, and plus the loot is good as well. With uh, I can find here a lot of copper, a lot of plastic, a lot of uh, gears. That's of the resources, right? That's pretty much what I really need. And yeah. Alright, and that would be it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's a lot more uh, to find there. I just, I gotta run to work. So if I want to upload this video today, I uh, gotta start editing. So I hope this video really helped you out. And uh, man, I think I found it useful. I think I'll find it and you guys will find it useful so don't forget to hit that like subscribe if you enjoyed and leave your comment now let's take a look what what we found throughout today's journey now the green bandana I found it in another location everything else I found it here so hooded rags <laughs> Whoa, okay military fatigues obviously wait why is he not wearing armor Hooded rags. Oh my god, this is the worst armor ever. It's not even an outfit. It takes off all of your gear. So what else do we have here? Prisoner Kalar. That glowing thing. There's a lot of them. So I found three. Usually I find around four or five. This thing right here. What else? Scavenger outfit. It's all right. What else? This that makes me look like a psychopath. <laughs> all right. So that's pretty much all of the outfits. There we go. All right, folks. So I hope you enjoyed the show and uh, do share the video somewhere in the media that would really help the channel grow so thank you for watching you have a good morning day and night whatever you guys located at i'll see you on the next video bye